Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Hmm? You're saying we should check the owl forest? What's up? Once we get to the mountain, the terrain won't be easy. We should rest up here before pressing on. But what about Xion? She's waiting for us. All the more reason to conserve our energy. Huh? It's not only the mountain. Hard though that may be, it's a pittance compared to what follows. Namely, Volron. We wear ourselves out now, or worse still, get injured. We might as well show up gift-wrapped. Right, Kisara? That's right. Besides, Alfin still hasn't fully recuperated yet. I'm fine. Don't stop on my account. Oh, really? Well, in that case, it's me who wants to take a rest for a while. Does that suit you better? <laughs> a little bit. So, Alfin, 300 years, huh? Care to share the secret to such a long and healthy life? I wish I knew. Once I left Lenigus, the next thing I remember is waking up in Calaglia. Everything in between is a blank. You mean, there are still gaps in your memory? I've heard of starships with devices that can stave off imminent death by putting their passenger into a deep sleep. They're usually only intended as a temporary solution until proper treatment for an ailment or injury can be obtained. You think he might have been asleep in that starship for 300 years? But why? What would be the point? Might this Naori have had a hand in it? What do you mean? If she's Renan like you say she is, she would have understood how to operate the starship better than yourself. <laughs> You're saying she deliberately put me to sleep for 300 years? Dohalim, that's a bit of a leap. Forgive me. I spoke out of turn. I'm merely thinking aloud, that's all. Shion and the Maiden Naori. After 300 years, it's not unreasonable to suspect they may be related. Shion is nearly the perfect image of her, yes? She also just so happens to be connected to you. Is it merely a coincidence? <sighs> like I've told you a million times already, I wouldn't know. Well, if you're absolutely certain that it couldn't have been Naori, then I guess I must have been mistaken. Complicated machinery can sometimes break down or have failures. Sorry for being presumptuous. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Alfin, you said the mask was to placate you, right? To keep your guilt and rage in check? And you were wearing it the whole time you were asleep, right? I guess I must have been. So that's 300 years you were wearing it. It's just a hunch, but do you think that the mask might be... The reason he lost all his memories? All but a select few strong ones. So deeply ingrained in his psyche that he saw them in the form of dreams. It's not completely out of the question. In which case, maybe it was the mask numbing his sense of pain, too. It's certainly possible. As for how, I wouldn't know, but the dampening effect on his psyche could have manifested itself physically as well. <sighs> I'm sorry for snapping at you back there. It's thanks to you that I feel like I'm... No, that we're finally getting somewhere with all this. No apologies necessary. Reading others' feelings has never been my strong suit. So he finally admits it. I really hope Xion's okay. I get why you're concerned, but if you don't rest when you can, 
You're going to regret it. She's right. We need our rest to conserve our strength. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, you two. No problem. We'll save Xion. I know we will. This came out so good, I almost hate having to eat it! Alone. I'm all alone. Let's go. We don't want to keep Xion waiting. What do you say we check back in on the ranch? I always hear you muttering to yourself whenever we're in battle. So, uh, just what are you saying? Why do you want to know? Does it bother you or something? Not really. It's just the way you talk is sometimes kind of creepy. So I was wondering if you vent your frustration through your magic. Are you yelling, you stupid jerk, or something like that to pump yourself up? What? No, that's not what's happening during my incantations. I'm just focused. So I match my tone to fit the mood of whatever I'm trying to invoke. Invoke? Uh, how do I put it? Basically, the elemental astral energy behind each art, I guess. Astral energy? Hold on, are you saying you can talk to astral energy? Uh, not exactly. But if I put emotion into what I say, it's easier for me to properly cast my arts. That makes sense? Kind of. Okay, so if you can talk to astral energy, then you can ask it to, like, predict the weather or find secret treasure? Wait, you don't really think that, do you? Or you can ask it to send out lightning to where there's bad guys lurking and... May lightning condemn those who bear false thunderblade! Ah, what are you doing? You almost fried me with that! I just asked the astral energy to send down lightning where there were annoying boys. I don't know what to do. Things can't go on like this. What do you mean? Ah! Oh, it's you, Rinwell. You were talking about me, weren't you? No, I wasn't. I've just been thinking about some things. Really? How unusual. Cut it out. I'm being serious here. Uh, sorry. I was thinking about... 
You know how I used to work for Ganabelt back when I was in Cislodia? Yeah, of course. You were brought in after the Snake Eyes killed your friends, right? I mean, you had to. Right. I used to have nightmares about it when I fell asleep. But lately, that's been happening a lot less. I don't know how to feel about that. That's a good thing, isn't it? You should be happy. Yeah, but... <sighs> I did a lot of terrible things back then. And I'm scared I'm starting to forget what I did. Okay, so let me just get all of this straight. You think you'll forget everything if you stop having those nightmares? Why? Because... You know me. I'm freaking stupid. But it sure doesn't sound to me like you've forgotten. Oh, well, yeah. But still. I don't think those nightmares going away means you've forgotten. Maybe it's a sign that you've come to terms with what you did. Come to terms? You mean like Alfin with his past? You think that's what's happening? Yeah, I do. <laughs> You're pretty amazing, Law. I am? Yeah. Not all of us have figured out how to accept our pasts. Least of all, me. Rinwell. going to climb? The villagers managed it on their escape from the city. We're going in the opposite direction, but where there's a will... <sighs> there's always a way, right? And it looks like we're out of options. Let's grit our teeth and go! Is it just me, or does Rinwell suddenly seem much more comfortable around Dohalim than she used to? I noticed that too. When the two of them came and found me together back on the beach, I could hardly believe my eyes. It's not like we had a choice or anything. Law and Kisara had to hang back to convince the villagers we meant them no harm. <sighs> more than that, though, there are a lot of things I've still got to come to terms with regarding Almadria. But... I guess I'm through making snap judgments based on someone's origin. At least, I'm trying to be. I guess you could say it's a work in progress. I see. You hear that, Law? Sounds like all that hard effort wasn't for nothing. Yeah. That's got to be reassuring to hear, right, Dohalim? Not being subjected to unwarranted suspicion is certainly welcome. Yeah, that long-winded way you have of talking, though? Not so much a fan of that. I think that's more of a personality thing than a Renin trait. 
Really? In that case, I won't have to feel guilty getting annoyed by it. <sighs> Be my 
to ensure you survive this. I will your weakness. It's over. Hit it hard. I'm ready, ready to go. Look sharp. Lightning time to play. See that? That training's paying off. You picked the wrong fight. Anything in normal is good. Those enemies aren't to me. There's no complaint here. Now you see what I can do. Take this. I'm ready. Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Begin! Rising Wyvern! Was that a new skill I saw back there? Indeed. Well, sort of. Actually, it's a family staple harkening back eight generations. Uh, maybe you can just write all this down? What's this thing? to a waterfall like this before. I bet it'd feel real refreshing to take... Let's see what we've got. I'll smash you! Huh? You picked the wrong fight! Tell me you're the key! It's over! Eagle running! That shell's hiding something big! Rise it out! Look at this shot! Try harder! Double demon fight! I'm out of here! Here I go! Let's do it! 
Demon's just dead! Flashing back! Easy! Way to go! Lightning Tiger Blade! Blade. Blade. Shattering the Attack time! Air Thrust! Dragon Claw! Dragon Claw! Oh, my oh, my oh, Demon's Demon Descent! Flashing Fang! With my comrades, I'm unstoppable! And what about without them? Uh, more stoppable? Flashing back! Benediction light. Damn 
longer will our healing arts last. And thus our strength yet grows. <laughs> 